Uh, yeah, every cow gives you something different. But it says that cow number three in there can't be reached without glitches, so it doesn't give you anything important. But... And I assume cow number three is the one that I didn't get anything from, because... Otherwise, like... It, uh, I somehow got the one that needs glitches, and I don't think I did any glitches, so... <laughs> Okay, well now we just gotta wait for the, uh, for 2 a.m., which it almost is. Oops. Let me, uh... Speed it up a little, the wait. <laughs> So I don't know if that's really, considering I have to play the song twice, if it's really going to actually save any time, but... Come on. about to happen, Romani will come outside. Come out, Rop Romani. Come out. Come on. Come on. Oops. There you are. Jeez, that kind of startled me. Make it a little easier so the aliens will go a little slower. Save state there. Save state again in a moment once it starts. Come on, what time does it start? He said 2 a.m., Romani. 2.30? Is it going to start at 2.30? Come on, oh man. Time's going so slow. Almost 2.30. There it is. Where is he barking? Over here, this is the closest one. So for those that have never done this, 
the dog barks in the direction of the closest alien. Okay, over here is the closest. Which is off in this one, because this one spawns pretty close. Okay, and what I have to protect is the barn. If they reach the barn, I lose. They are not aiming for the house, they are aiming for the barn. Oh, I could see the circle from that one going through the building. Yeah, they do not all spawn equidistance. Some of them spawn closer. So there are some that are bigger threats. I would have liked arrows. I know the alien dropped arrows, but I kind of turned too quick. And it's not worth trying to get back. So at least I got the, uh, see, look how close that thing spawns. At least I got the large quiver before this all began. And when you kill it, it immediately responds at its spawn point. So that one, like, it's the biggest hassle out of them. This one I feel kind of is a little close to. It. But... This one's closest right now. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. This one again back here. Not only is this one spawn the closest, this one is also kind of the sneakiest because it's behind the building. Thankfully, the little circles from them go through buildings, so you can kind of see where it is. But it's easy to forget about it if you haven't done this a bajillion times like me. I will say this mini game freaked me out as a kid. Like this was the creepiest mini game in the game for me as a kid. Honestly, though, without the uh... oh, this one's gotten close. So did this one. Without the uh, normal alien invading music, this the creepiness of this is a little diminished. This is just the Deku Trees theme. And like it's for this theme is foreboding, but it's not like tense like the normal alien theme. Which is the closest? For here, this one? Okay. So it doesn't even set them back that far. That being said, even though they seem like, oh, I'm not making much progress there, I do have to keep doing it. If I don't constantly do it, they're gonna sneak up on me. I think I have to do it till 6 a.m., but it might be, might be earlier. Might be 5 something. It's almost 5 in game.
That said, outside of the tenseness of this minigame, it's really not that bad of a minigame. It's... especially if you have slow time like this. Like... And compared to all the other archery games in this game, this is probably the easiest archery minigame. That was kind of funny music to use there. <laughs> okay, what do I get? You cheapskate. I saved your farm! You pay me a single ruby? You know what? You deserve to have your cows kidnapped. Let, let me on your opponent. I'm getting out of here. You're welcome! Okay, but that's not the end of this quest line. We will have to fight or help, uh, Kremia. What time do we have to be back there? Uh... 6 p.m. On day two. I will... Save state, cause, so we... I don't... You don't need to do that for every five bombs! Okay, so... Let's see, there's a bunch of checks that got- did get opened up when we got bows for, like, just spots we have to shoot at. So... Uh... Let's see... Bow, uh, do the aliens... Uh... Let's see, what else does Bo need it for? Uh, I want to skip the archery minigames as long as I can, to be honest. I'll come to them eventually, but they have no higher chance of getting a... giving anything than any other check, so like... Not much motivation. Uh... Let's see. I'll do... Uh... Money around that. None of those. Uh, the bi, the, yeah. The thing is, depending on what falls out, it could fall in the water, and I can't get it in the water unless I have Zora mask. So I'm not in a rush to get that one. I was doing that when I was kind of very low on checks, but you really have to have the RNG if it falls on the lily pad, and that's complete luck. So you could be trying it repeatedly for works. But thank you for the reminder nonetheless. I will eventually get back to it and try that one. I just want to, if possible, get the uh, Zora mask before then. Or at least get the easier checks out of the way. There's one in South Clocktown though right now, so... And this one actually gives me three things, this check I'm about to do, so...
There we go. Wow. Is that two heart pieces? That was two heart pieces. All the way to fourth heart. I'm early enough in the game that heart pieces are nice, even if they don't unlock anything, and I have a lot of checks anyways I can do. Uh... Let's see... I can't, not that, not that... Not, nothing in North Clocktown. East Clocktown has... Uh, nothing. In nothing. West Clocktown. Nothing. Uh. Laundry pool, nothing. Yeah. Uh, Termina Field. Okay, there's one. I think this one will drop multiple items also. Okay. I don't know where are you. Let me on. Is it the Great Bay entrance? Is that the side it's on? Yeah, it is. Take some steps forward. Okay, there's a, uh, swamp token, cool. Let's see, what else? That, not that, not those, not any of these. Uh, yeah, none of those. Okay, is there any milk road? I don't think so. Yeah, not in Milk Road. Romani Ranch, I think we got everything we can do. Get up Romani Ranch right now, yeah. Southern Swamp, uh... Yeah, we got everything except for the one song we can't reach. Uh, the Swamp House. I could go back to the Swamp House, that is an option. Uh... I can't actually reach that. Wait, I just re remembered. I should check to see if any of the other grottos have beehives. Uh, let's see. No, not done that I could reach. Okay. So I can't do the Deku Pass, Butler Race, Woodfall, Woodfall Temple. I can go to the Mountain Village. Let's do that. At this point, I think the Deku Mask would be one of the best things we can get. But the, uh... 
The Zora Mask would be good too. The Hookshot. Hookshot would be really great if we get Hookshot actually. Hookshot would do a ton. That might be the best thing actually. My god! Why can't I hit you? Jeez! That was a train wreck! Okay, some of the snowballs do have randomized contents, I think. I don't think the trees do. I love the backflip. Okay, this isn't worth it. Just attack me, I have no shield! Perfectly decent attack cycles for him to miss. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty much what happened. Can I please? Thank you. Okay. I don't think the tree is. Yeah, I don't think these snowballs are. It would only be snowballs that have fixed drops. It's usually always the same drop. No, I'm not doing this again. What ended up being hot spring water? Oh, you mean what gave us hot spring water? I think it was regular water. Yeah, regular water's hot spring water. I have a, I have a notepad here. It, it was regular water. Fish was uh, magic mushrooms. There's one. Swamp. Spelltoa. We found our first boss remains. We found our first boss remains. Three more to go. Adalba's remains in a random snowball. Yes. Look at that, that's, that's, that's great. Every bit as exciting as I thought it would to be have this boss remains in random spots. Ah, oh, cool. That's worth it. Worth it! He died in the snow. <laughs> well, I mean, he wasn't made for snow. He's like, he's the swamp boss. Who took him out to the snow? Murdered by goat. <laughs> oh no, he's betrayed by his fellow, uh, fellow boss. Okay. 
I want to fight you. I don't want to fight you. I just, I don't even want to. You're not worth it. Okay, last time I did blindly go up there. I'd rather not this time. It's awful to, without Lens of Truth to try to go up that. Like, I have, I had the route memorized, but it was like trying to feel my way through the, uh, Or trying to, like, guess the distance for each. Okay, yeah, hot spring water. That would be better to do on day one. Because on day two, they need the, the golden, uh... The gold powder. Adult wallet! There we go! That opens up some checks. I think we even have the wall upgrade to afford it. You don't think so, Dark Data? <laughs> I know you said that before then, because there's just there's stream delay. <laughs> but I mean ask and you shall receive. We can afford a bunch of stuff now. <laughs> Instantly wrong. <laughs> and the, the game just, the game couldn't let you have that. The game was like, did somebody say we, you can't do something? Okay, so we can't, we can't get any further than this. Well, I like that fairy. I like that, where, wait, where's fairy? There's fairy. There you go. Okay, so I remember lots of stuff we saw for sale, but all of it was, nothing of it was for a check. That being said, I know we can get the Razor Sword in Clock Town. And one of the things with how the randomizer works is that the second sword upgrade or the Razor Sword, the, first, the sword upgrade that you get that usually only lasts 100 hits or until you rewind time. It lasts uh, forever in this until you get the next upgrade. So we are going to get that sword upgrade. It was here. Hey, was it Razor Sword or was it Gilded? It was Gilded Sword. But will it? That was not a guild of sword. Oh, cool. It kicks in after I... Okay, cool. Well, I got fooled by that. I was indeed a fool. I was super curious why there was a gilded sword when we didn't have the other sword, because they were supposed to be, like, progressive. Oops. Okay, let's buy, uh... Let's buy this fairy. It was a troll. It was indeed a troll. 
sixth one for Woodfall. Okay, that's everything that matters there. Sad, yeah. I mean... That's kind of funny, because that was the long game troll. That was the troll that... ...had me invested for two whole streams. 302, okay, I can't afford that heart piece. Are you actually selling powder kegs? You are selling powder... No, it might be... It might be random. We'll do it. We have easy ways to farm money. We have easy ways to farm money. Let's just buy what we can buy. No, you know what? We'll save state first. I don't usually get that cheeky, but... I just don't know if this is randomized. Okay, it is... Let's, yeah. We'll reload that save state. It is not randomized. That is something that I could have looked up in the settings, if that is a check. But I figured it would be faster to just do that. Obviously, I'm not going to do that every time. The... the the sword, yeah, that the sword got us. The potion hag selling heart pieces, yeah, she, my, I think she was. But I'm first. I, we have a lot of a lot of shops we can open up now. So there is Mr. Tingle. Though the potion, I can't go to her. She leaves on the second day if you have it saved. L LG emptiness. She leaves on the second day if you haven't saved her sister, so I can't actually go to her in this cycle. Wait, wait, wait. Okay. All things considered, this was a pretty, uh, productive stream. By his dark soul magics. <laughs> pretty much. I mean, that seems like a very tingle thing, though, to, to have, like, dark magic secretly. Okay, I can check the tingle at... Okay, the one in Terminal Root has nothing good. The one in Milk Road has something. Stop bobbing. Uh, it would fall straight fairy, but... Yeah, that's the seventh one. We never did check the ocean tangle. I, I thought of that while I was... Doing all these checks, I was like... Next is out, or well, next is mountain. But we haven't seen mountain one. There's mountain. Yeah, we haven't seen mountain one. We haven't gone that way yet. Great, uh, Great Bay Coast, though. Yeah. I'll check it. I probably should have gone and got money first, but. We'll have to get money at... Oh, is, he, is he up? Is he up? No, no, he is on the top. Above the top one. We have to check the uh, shop in the Zora 
There we go, the Zora shop. No, he is above the lower part, but it's easier to shoot there. Wow, that's gotta kill his knees. Jeez. <gasps> we could have gotten that all this time! Oh, I'm so mad. We could have gotten that all this time. I'm not- I could do the thing with the Zora eggs, but... We have 15 minutes, so I want to try to be as productive as possible. God, that was annoying. Okay, so... Let's go get more money. No, actually we're not gonna get money yet, we're gonna go do the maze. Okay, the Zora, that unlocks a bunch. It's kind of funny that we're getting the Deku Mask last. I think we got the Deku Mask last the previous time, too. Did she charge 20? Five, or five for Zora. Like. Okay. Okay. Uh, you gotta let me around. Oh no. That was, that was bad. We're, we might be screwed then. Man, it was over here. I was like, there's no way it's all the way to the side. No! No! So close! Great Bay going three for three in transformation masks. We'll see. I mean, really, it's whether it it didn't go four for four because you can't forget that the fierce deity is a transformation mask. Did we get the fierce deity? I don't remember where we got it, but I don't think it was Great Bay. There we go. Gimme. Magic jar. Wow. <laughs> okay, so there is... A couple chests in Termina Field we can do with this. The first is underwater over here. Honey oh yeah, it was in the Honey and Darlings, the basket. We can't use. Got it. Okay. Okay, let's see what these are. Or this is. 
20 rubies, that was just a red ruby. That's it, just 20 rubies. Cool. Glad I didn't try to do the RNG with that with arrows. Okay, let's... Let's grab some money and go to the, uh... The Zora... Shop. We have like 10 minutes. We can... We can do some stuff in the Zora area. Which I guess is kind of out of order, but... Hey, we had the money for it, so let's just let's just get it done. Uh Zora Cape. Oh, we still have the we have the picture. We can show the picture. Stray Fairy for Woodfall. It's one. Let's go show the picture to this guy up here of Good Lulu. Or the Good Lulu picture. Hey, like there's a Good Lulu and a Bad Lulu. Uh. Wow. Keep the change. <laughs> what an asshole thing to say, give me one ruby. Keep the change. That's like paying somebody a penny and just being like, keep the change. get bad Lulu. I thought bad Lulu's... Do I get it from like a weird side? How do I get bad Lulu? There we go. Okay, let's go deliver this. Do I have the... I do have the deed in this timeline. Okay, here's the bad picture. Bomb bag? That doesn't unlock any checks because we had bomb masks, but it means I don't have to blow myself up anymore to, for, to do bomb stuff. Green ruby for 183 rubies, no sir. Oops, I need to talk to you first. Yeah. Bombs.
Oops. Well, even if we had the Deku mask, that is just bomb shoes up there. Which we can hold now, but... I think there is a sound check to do over here. Okay, the sound check doesn't give anything. These are all kind of mini games that aren't super quick checks, and we're pretty much at the end of our time. We'll go in here, but we're not going to do the jam session. We're going to save in front of here. We'll pull this out. Oops. We need to talk to him. Just because I want to make sure we remember that we're... Okay, there. So this is what we'll do next time. We'll do the jam session first thing next time. And, uh, yeah, that's where we'll leave off. 